Howdy, Crazy Ron here. Taking a break from recording, uh, you know, big titles and stuff, and decided to hit up an indie game. Uh, this, this was on sale at Steam at the time of this recording. It's like, I don't know, same five percent off, so it's like two fifty. Um, from what I from what I read and watched around, it looked it looked pretty damn cool. <laughs> it's like one of those uh, arcadey, you know, quote unquote restaurant sim games, but it looked a little bit more fast paced and really something I could get into. I don't know. I always like these kinds of games. Just like react on impulse type of stuff. I don't know, but um, it it looked interesting. Uh, I'll just do a quick playthrough of it. See see if it's worthy of you know continuous recording. I don't know. With with a small game like this, you, you can't expect to get too far. Um, had to shut off the music because uh, it's like Elvin music. After a while, it gets obnoxious. I mean, listen. <laughs> so. Well, we'll we'll start out at the uh, beginning and work our way through. As you can tell, completely new. So, uh, welcome to Sherry Soda Tower. This historical building was once home to the luxurious Cook Serve Delicious restaurant, but has since been in disrepair, along with the rest of the tower. However, the recent economy has filled this tower to capacity, and the owners of the tower would like to reopen Cook Serve Delicious restaurant and put you at the helm. Wow. Apparently they haven't been informed of my really bad entrepreneurial drive, you know? You'll need to take this now zero-star cafe and turn it into a five-star world-class restaurant. But first, we need to very quickly learn the basics. <laughs> yeah, please please reopen this restaurant to its former glory, but we're just going to take some guy off the street. That's pretty much what it is. Oh, uh, wow. Decent view. This is your main restaurant serving your hey, It doesn't look the best, but hey, you need to fix it up in no time. Uh, you press the bottom right pause button or hit escape to pause the game at any time during the day. Sweet. Uh, to the left is your prep station. Start with your four, but earn more as you gain stars for your restaurant. You can take orders and serve food from here, so let's give it a try. Uh, what the hell is that? Oh, this is a corn dog. To be honest, dirty mine here. Um, this is a customer ticket. Put, press number on the keyboard to start the order. Cost dog, ketchup, mustard, please. Now you have the corn dog in front of you. Oh, that's cool. So use a keyboard. Right menu shows in order to what to press the ingredients in, and the bottom ticket how the customer wants the food made. Sweet. The right menu. Oh, okay, the keys. Okay. I thought it was like what order to make it in, just not the keys. Ketchup mustard, so that'd be that'd be that. Uh great job. There are three different types of satisfaction levels, perfect orders, average orders, and bad orders. Doesn't pay. Wow, what a dick. Dine and dash. Try for those perfect orders. Okay. Use your mouse to complete orders. Trying, trying using the mouse on just right clicking the customer order ticket. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I still think the key would be faster. There you go. Of course, you cook for it. Now use the mouse and or keyboard for the remaining foods. I prefer the keyboard because I could probably do it faster. Cook the meat before preparing the food. Click to use the or use the keyboard to call to call the order to begin. So, M. One meat fatty. It's not cooking. You need to wait a few seconds for the meat to grill at the right temperature before serving. Once the order turns blue, it's ready to be prepped. Select the order too soon or too late, and your customer will have robbery meat. They'll likely have a bad rating. Okay. I have to remember that. Burger is ready for additional prepping. Click on one to finish the order. Uh, sweet. They quite the order right, but that's okay. You can always get set different keys for different ingredients in the key binding menu if you don't like the default controls. Ah, okay. There are two types of orders that you'll find in Cook Serve Delicious. When an order is highlighted blue after cooking, it will require additional prep work. If an order is highlighted yellow, it requires no more prep work and is ready to be served to customers. Simply select it to serve immediately. Oh, okay. That's cool. Only for one order at a time. However, you can serve yellow orders to customers easily, even when prepping a different order. Simply press the number to serve any time. Customers won't wait around forever for their food to be taken. You'll notice the food is slowly disappearing from the screen. It goes away completely. Customers leave angry and Cause oh, bad buzz for your restaurant. There are ways of extending customer patience via equipment. If you don't like the game. Okay. 
Uh, also, chores to continue with, that's enough tutorials for now. You can always select practice chores and tutorials menu to try out all the chores you'll need to complete daily. Or that, you learn the basics of cooking and serving. Yay! So, I'm basically one man running an entire fucking restaurant. That's just dandy. It's gonna be that bad I can't hire people to help me out here. I'm, I'm, I'm like I'm like a CEO of my own restaurant, and I just have to do it by myself. Uh, diving the management of cooks are delicious is vital ensuring the customers are always flowing to your restaurant. Uh, it's me managing menu for where you can find the food menu. Buy items and a whole lot more. You work here from 9 to 10. Huh. Each day you come here to plan out your business. First, we need to buy some food. You have starting budget. 3 to 5 foods out of 20 offer. Oh, that's cool. Uh, you need a few foods for carved equipment, obviously. It's grill or deep fire to expand the select foods you vary. The equipment. Alright. Unless our series of boosters. Oh, cool. Red icons. Some foods bring in more customers during the day, others scare them away under certain conditions. Alright. Uh, Customers, if your buzz is at 20%, customers will very slowly trickle in, but if your buzz goes at 80, you'll have a very steady flow of people at all times. Perfect orders gain buzz. Average orders add no buzz, and bad orders subtract from your buzz. Sounds like a really bad alcoholic drink. You can see all of this in the action in all this in action in the daily buzz menu. Both your active menus and customers will determine what order your buzz. Once you've bought foods, you need to add them to the active menu. The active menu is a board that customers will be able to order from during the day. You can serve up to six foods at a time. Sweet. Your customers are all tenants of Sherry Soda Tower, and they carry new foods constantly. You need to add and remove foods to the menu every two days to keep them fresh. Every two days? Hmm. This food has a staple booster, which allows them to be fresh constantly. So can we just cycle them? Those are the basics. Get prepped for first day. Good luck. Oh, cool, so I got a computer. Sweet. Uh, 11 star Iron Chef. Okay, that's just great. Oh, we got foods. Can't get those. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Key bindings. Wow, that's a lot of food. Wait, did I see what I thought I saw? <laughs> what? Draw hair, draw eyes, draw ears. What the hell? A robbery? Okay, so I'm gonna get robbed. Gotcha. Okay, let's start with something simple. How much one do you have? 75? Try out. What does that do? Does that just let me... Oh, that's cool. Oh, overflown. Mm. Fill the glass up until you get a nice foamy top. Or fill the mug, you don't have a foamy mess. And that. Okay. Oh, that is so cool. So you basically. Basically allows you to practice. Damn it. Okay, I don't think I should be just serving this guy beer the entire time. Okay, so that's cool. You practice, but just for the just for the sake of it, we'll just go straight, you know, straight in. Uh, or is it back to foods? Here we go. Let's let's start with something simple. Not upgradable. Not upgradable seems like a big thing. A soda, lasagna. Wow, this seems this seems a bit high end as we get here. Who's that pizza? Hell's yeah, why not? Oh, that's cool. We can confirm it. So you don't incidentally, you know, accidentally buy it. Don't need a steak. <laughs> Who needs salad? Do we get like staple American foods? Pizza, corn dog. Is pretzel American? -y? Really American-y? Uh... Yeah, we don't want people to be thirsty. Why not? Ice cold beer! Hopefully I don't need any more. I'll just get ice cream. Everyone loves ice cream. Equipment. Oh, sweet. Oh, so I could have bought these. I almost, I almost wasted all my money on food. 
Uh, we'll start something simple with the, with the fryer. Uh, so now I can actually buy some foods, right? Like the burger. That's a lot of money for a burger. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna just stick with that. Um, got like tutorials. Any, anything else? Active menu. So I can only do four things today. I want to do something simple, like that. That. Bingo. And uh, try it. Begin. Corn dog. Just, just catch it, please. Sweet. I'm loving this. Just gotta remember the keys. <laughs> it's just a waiting game. Is that sun gonna move across the sky? That would be sick. Tomato sauce and cheese. Uh. Huh. That's cool. Oh yeah, so I gotta. Ah. I keep an eye on it. There we go. Mustard. Sweet. <laughs> this is kind of fun. It's kind of like Nazi zombies. You just gotta. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> Wash and sanitize hands. Uh, medium. There we go. With ice. Give me a second here. Uh, medium water. Yay. Pizza. Uh, uh, sauce, cheese, pepperoni, sausage. Can't wait to get this picked up. Cause apparently I gotta I gotta flush every toilet. Large tea. Oh, forgot to give him ice. Damn. I don't have mushrooms and olives. Oh, I see. No. Small grip with ice. I see, I see how this is going to be an issue. Uh, what is it? Large cold ice? I need to change, I just need, I just need the hotkeys. I need to change hotkeys because, uh, this seems a lot. Cheese, pepperoni, sausage, bacon. Oh. Bacon. Yo. Oh. <laughs> Tomato sauce, cheese, pepperoni, pepperoni. Yeah, I really need to change this hotkey because that just seems like. Oh no. It's a bit burnt. Uh, cheese, pepperoni, sausage. Yay. Don't the food be burnt too much. Damn, so the lunch rush gets pretty. Pretty, uh. God damn, I seriously need to. Because I'm still looking down at the keyboard, trying to get this right, because this just looks. What the hell? That's cool. Just butter, please. <laughs> just one spritz of hand sanitizer, because, you know, that's totally gonna cover the cooking department. Cinnamon? It's kind of like uh, Nazi zombies in Call of Duty. It's like you start out really, really damn slow and then it starts picking up and you're like, I didn't want this. I did not want this. Large deck with ice. Sweet. Come on, come on. I could, t I could press faster than this. Just butter. I need the keys to be in a certain order so that I don't even have to look down because they're kind of gapped far apart. Like I need to have the arrow keys or something. I gotta move them over so that I can have I can play this all with one hand. That'd be freaking amazing. Be speed. Speed. I am speed. Come on. Get your food here. Tea with ice. Starting to get the hang of it. Apparently, no one, no one flushes. 
uh, tomato sauce, cheese, bacon, and mushrooms. Uh, tomato, cheese, mushroom. Uh, large tea with ice. Oh, shit. Gave the wrong order. Wow. I already screwed that one up. Tomato, cheese, pepperoni, sausage, bacon. You want, you want the whole thing, don't you? Three, uh, medium grape with ice. Yeah, having to reach for ice just sucks ass. Uh, tomato, cheese, and sausage. Uh, fuck. <laughs> Panic! <laughs> Medium group with ice. Whew, rush hour ended. Medium group with ice. Salt and butter. Whew! Ketchup. It's a rush! I have to look down at my keyboard. I need to put these keys closer together. Maybe after this one I'll, I'll do that. So I can be like... Mr. Efficient fishing air right here. Come on, come on! How many people in the building are using this one bathroom? I gotta freaking flush it every single time. I know how how the how the the thing is intuitive. Like the first letter is the key, but at the same time, it's like it's not within reach, you know. Uh, tomato cheese. This is gonna- I bet this is gonna pick up like a freaking crazy ass as you get farther and farther in the game. Tomato, cheese, pepperoni, uh, bacon, and onions. There's a rat! There's a rat! Whew! Day complete! Uh, yeah. Negative buzz 3%. Wow, that's... Checklist. Complete 20 days of service. Wow, I, I got a while to go. Six food drinks for your menu. Over 100 tips. Class safety inspection. Wow, well, that's that's day one. So, I'm going to have to figure out my hotkeys and stuff. And So, this is basically... This right here. This is a... Uh, cook, serve, delicious. So, uh, if you like it, go out and buy it. It's pretty cheap right now. I think I think on full sale though it's like ten bucks. I don't know. Um, sale I think uh, this Christmas sale ends pretty soon, so it's it's entirely up to you. Um, if you want to keep on watching, I plan to keep on posting a little bit until uh, until this just becomes so absurdly difficult that I won't look competent while playing it. <laughs> just it's bad enough to mumble around on all the other games. So I'm crazy Ron, and I'll see you around.